Thanks for watching this video today. We are going to talk today about one of the new neighborhoods in Staten Island, but it's not really so new because it's been here for a very, very long time. That's right, we're talking about St. George. <laughs> Just Wanaka. I am a local realtor right here in Staten Island, New York. If you know of anybody looking to do anything, also, we get people moving to Staten Island, New York left and right here. And quite frankly, I just absolutely love it. So if you have any questions about a specific area, do me a favor. Again, drop them in the comments listed below. Send me a text. Send me an email. Send up a smoke signal. Contact me on social media. Get me. Find me. And quite frankly, if you can't find me, you ain't trying hard enough. This video is going to talk to you all about what's going on in the St. George area of Staten Island, New York. There's a lot of wonderful things going on down in St. George. The area has been going through a little bit of a revitalization. But before we go in and have a conversation about St. George, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button below. So anytime that we do a new video or new area video or a new video on real estate, you'll get notified right away. So I really appreciate it. And without any further ado... Let's get into it. Hey, this St. George area of Staten Island is one of Staten Island's oldest and just most beautiful areas with some really nice older homes, but it also has that mix of, of newer and newer construction. There's been a lot, a lot of things made right now about St. George and about the new developments that are coming in. You've got the Empire Outlets uh, Factory Outlet Mall right adjacent to the Staten Island Ferry. You've got a brand new hotel going right next door. You've got the Lighthouse Museum. You have the brand new courthouse. You've got, and of course, the St. George Theater. Who can forget the St. George Theater after all with that beautiful new marquee that they just got. So there's a lot of wonderful things going on about St. George that is just starting to come back. And one of the most important things about St. George is its proximity to Manhattan, to the city. You're only a ferry ride away. One of the other wonderful things going on about St. George, too, is we have our own ballpark, our own minor league baseball affiliate, the Staten Island Yankees. So those are some of the small little things that are going on in St. George. But let's not forget the food in St. George. There are a bunch of different restaurants that are, that are popping up all over the place. You've got a wonderful, wonderful, eclectic different types of restaurants that are down there right now. You've got your own mainstay restaurants that have been there for an extended period of time. And then you have, as the expression goes, the new cheek places. You've got the, you've got Daddio's down at the bottom of Victory Boulevard. You've got the flagship brewery is located down there in St. George as well. You've got so many different uh, restaurants and, and different spots to eat. You're not going to know what to do with yourself. Hey, I wanted to thank you for checking out this real quick video that I did on St. George today. Do me a favor. If you'd be so inclined, give me a, let me know what you think of this video in the comment section down below. And hey, do me a favor. Again, don't forget, hit that subscribe button. So anytime we do a new video, you're going to get notified right away and you can check it out. If you know of anybody looking to do anything, also, we get people moving to Staten Island, New York, left and right here. And quite frankly, I just absolutely love it. So if you have any questions about a specific area, do me a favor. Again, drop them in the comments listed below. Send me a text. Send me an email. Send up a smoke signal. Contact me on social media. Get me. Find me. And quite frankly, if you can't find me, you ain't trying hard enough. That being said, thanks for watching. Have a great day.